guys, I'm back with this makeup tutorial. This is a smoky, sultry look made with Nabla Dreamy 2, the Mystic Palette. I really enjoyed making this look because uh, it was so easy to make and I love those nice reflections. We have lots of dimension in this look. We have some purple, blue and bronzy shade at the same time. I already did my face. I used this foundation from Nabla. This is a close-up futuristic foundation. I like it because it has a soft matte finish so it's not too flattening and it gives a natural look. Then I bronze my face with Lancome. This is a bronzer, the French Glow and this is the shade Warm Sensuality. And for blush and highlighter, I used Skin Glazing from Nabla and this is the color Truth. The color is so pretty, this is a rose gold peachy shade. I like to apply my highlighters with a big brush, something like this. It doesn't look like a beam of light in just one place, it's um, diffused on all over the face. So it creates more a natural glow from within, which I really prefer because um, it looks natural. You can still see that you are wearing makeup but it's not too obvious and all over the face. Now onto the eyes, I'm using Nabla Dreamy 2. This is the Mystic Palette. I think it's really 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 pretty. Rather natural, at least for me, even if we have lots of shimmers and even some uh, glitters here, but we have some beautiful neutrals, and those also are quite neutrals. Uh, for me, a uh, gold and bronze shades are neutrals. This shade in particular, this is uh, I think my favorite hidden place, which is very rich. You can see we have some purple, but also green. Um, absolutely uh, beautiful. The first shade I'm going to be using is the New Past, which is that rich brown color. And I will just place it here. Always make sure that it's symmetrical. I'm using New Past and Offline this time. And I place it onto the lower lashes. The Offline is really dark. It's like a dark um, eggplant shade. This one also, it's so pretty. It has a special finish. It is a latex matte finish. Place it here underneath. And we want to blend it. And I like to uh, push the shade here so it creates a more elongated line. And with a much smaller brush, I apply the product here onto the outer part of the eyes. And this is the same shade of line. It's really uh, different from um, any other eyeshadow that I know. It is a latex matte finish. Uh, it's matte, but uh, it's almost a uh, rubbery feel, almost wet. You can also go with your finger for a more um, impactful application. But I use uh, the brush today. You see, you place the product here. Again, uh, I use small dabs like this. With this product, we don't want to uh, swipe it to blend that a little bit more. And 
And with my finger, I'm going with with a um, hidden place. I like to use my fingers in general for those shades. No, that's really rich. We mostly see the purple, but if you turn your face, you can see a little bit of green also. And I think uh, that makes it so gorgeous. I'm using the base again here. And uh, yeah, no, I put a little bit so much product in there. Finger is not as precise as a brush, but uh, you can apply the product here with the brush. Oh, this is so pretty and light. And onto uh, the lower lash line, I'm using Mirabilia, which is that blue shade. This time I'm going to add the brush because more precise. Oh, I love the shade also. You know, this is a wearable proper blue color. Wearable for me, it's, uh, it means still neutral. Of course, you can wear anything you want. I'm using Lucid Dream with a pencil brush. This one has some glitters in it. And, uh, I'm just adding some mascara, just uh, major pleasure mascara, the one I prefer to use right now. And as always, I remove the excess of this. I'm done with the eye look. And the last step, I'm using this liquid lipstick from Nabla. This is the creamy formula and the shade is called My Rule. This is a mauve shade. I think it's so pretty. You see it goes with the purple that I have on the eyes. So this is the final result and you can see uh, this was pretty easy. I don't use too many products to create those looks. I love to keep it simple. I hope you will enjoy this look and maybe that you will recreate it. If you want to see more content, you can find me on Instagram where I post every day. Bye!